What is going on guys? Have you ever been running your Arma 3S vehicle and all of a sudden your wheel flies off with the nut still attached to the wheel? Uh, if you have, you're in luck because I'm going to show you how to fix that so it never happens again. Uh, it's happened to me actually recently. My, both wheels uh, came off. This one came off first and that one came off. I think the next pack I ran, the other one came off. I thought it was the same one. I was like, no, it's not. It's the opposite. Um, but what it is, is there's a set screw that holds the axle onto the drive shaft. And uh, if that's not thread locked, it will come loose. And I don't know if Arma thread locks them at the factory or not, but they will come loose. I only have 15 packs on this new 3S Typhon. Um, I do have another Typhon that I converted. It was the Mega that I converted the uh, 3s and 4s i have like 70 packs on that one but long story on that um anyway it's pretty quick pretty simple fix all you do is remove remove your wheel so remove your wheel nut take the wheel off get yourself a two millimeter hex driver take this screw out Oops, take that out. There's also a screw, a set screw right here. You need to loosen this up. This is holding the pin. This is holding this little pin that keeps the, keeps this attached. Don't lose your pin. So now everything should come right out of there. And there it is. So what's going on is there is a screw. Can you see if I can get the camera for you? There's a screw down in here, way down in here. I think I'm pretty sure it's two millimeter. Yes, whole way down through. If you can see, it's going to go through, and then it hits that screw. So guys, what's going on here is when that set screw in there backs out from vibration and heat and everything else. Uh, once it backs out, it'll stay in here. It won't be attached to this axle piece anymore. But it will stay in here. You won't lose it. I haven't lost it. It usually stays in this little area here. I don't think it can get out of there. It can't back out. But your whole axle will fly off with the wheel. So that whole assembly just goes flying. That's why your wheel and the axle and the everything that the bolt, the 17 millimeter nut, everything that's attached goes with it. Um, it's a simple fix. The little screw in there, just put some uh, thread locker. Just put some blue thread locker on there, uh, on that screw down in the hole, whatever you want to do, and uh, let that sit overnight. At least let it sit for 24 hours to harden. I already did mine the other day, and it's see it's in there tight now. It won't even hardly come loose because of the thread locker I put on it. I mean, it will come loose. The blue, the blue will come loose, but it's tight. I don't think it's going to come off again. We'll see. So it's a simple fix to that. Uh, just use some thread locker, some blue thread locker. Don't use red because you will, you're not going to be getting it undone if you use red. I mean, you may be able to heat this up if you use red, but it's going to melt the plastic uh, of the drive shaft and it just, I wouldn't do it. So that's it guys. Simple fix to do that problem. Anyway, till next time, guys, the RC Element, out.